Saturday, the Salvation Army is taking more than 200 kids in Colorado Springs to J.C. Penney for a shopping spree. The annual event is a big help for families who need a little extra support before the start of school. KRDO News Channel 13's Andrea Herrera talked with one family who says this aid will help them in a big way, and it's absolutely Colorado. Andrea. Bart, Heather, that's right. Alicia Lowe and her daughter were homeless for about three weeks before receiving help from the Salvation Army. Now her daughter is enrolled in school and will soon be a part of the annual back to school shopping spree thanks to the nonprofit. Skylin is six years old and this year she'll be entering first grade. I'm pretty excited for me and my daughter, you know, we we've come a long ways from where we was. Like Skylin and her mom, there are several other children in Colorado Springs that need extra help ahead of the new school year. For a single parent these days, it costs at least two grand to support a child a month, at least, mm -hmm. if not a little more. It's just it's hard. On Saturday, August 5th, the Salvation Army in Colorado Springs will take more than 200 kids to J.C. Penney at the Citadel Mall for a shopping spree. We were, we were quite surprised and a little overwhelmed. Our online portal for families to sign up for the shopping spree uh, with 200 kids, it filled up in about a week and a half. And so now we're actually a little over. We have, I think it's 209 kids that have signed up for it. Right now, the nonprofit says they will spend about $1,500 on the big trip, but it's still looking for another $5,000 to reach their goal. If you want to donate, you can go to our, our website of helpcoloradosprings.com, and that main landing page has a link there. You can see uh, the little thermometer grow to the $20,000 goal that we have to fully fund the back to school shopping spree. On Saturday, each student will receive a $100 gift card for school clothes, and JCPenney will actually be offering an extra 30% off to help families. Reporting in studio, Andrea Herrera, KRDO News Channel 13.